Hello everybody, welcome to the thrilling conclusion of the anime or not anime thing E. Um I'm Iggy and I have guests. You can say hi now. If you want to, you don't have to, but I would appreciate it. I don't want to, but I guess I'll say hi. Uh I suppose I'll say hi too. Hey. Hi. I'm Crow, by the way. I'm Ra Ra, but nobody cares. <laughs> and I'm I'm Iggy, but but I don't care. <laughs> uh, anyway, we are already ready to start this show. I hope that everybody in the stream can hear us just fine. Please tell us you can hear us. <laughs> That's very important. <laughs> we had some audio issues when setting this up, so I'm not really sure. But you should be able to hear all of us. Like all three of us. Somebody, please. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to know if it works before we uh, get this rolling. Because I'm afraid. I'm so afraid it doesn't work. <laughs> are we even streaming? <laughs> I, I think we are. Are we? Yeah, it's, it's showing up on my end, kind of. Well, it's just reloading us as I'm logging in, but yeah. Well, um, let's just give it a few okay, more yes, seconds. I, I, I can... think they're just messing with us. <laughs> yeah, I, I can hear us. Good, you can hear us. Um, okay then. I guess we are ready to actually start. So let's start. Why not? There's yeah. something else to do. Alright. <laughs> Oh boy. Let me drop this facade of fake loading screens to reveal the real <laughs> loading. I, I keep making that joke. I know it's bad, but I will never stop. <laughs> okay. So the first match we have, much like at the last pay-per-view, will actually feature Lord of Butt. I, I figured that out, like, this morning when I set up the betting sheet, which I forgot to do yesterday. Whoops. I'm gonna fight. Is he still on probation? I don't know. No, actually. Is, I, I didn't check. I didn't check. <laughs> but yeah, uh, he will fight Big Scary Owl. We decided that Big Scary Owl is an anime. Because sure, why not? Uh, owls are anime. Oh, sure, yeah, yeah. I, I suppose that works. I do have those really disturbingly big eyes and small beaks. Well, see, the thing is, I don't think Owl really cares much about this anime, not anime thing, so he just joined one team to have a match today <laughs> because he hasn't had one in yeah. a while. Yeah. He joined hoping to recruit the entire anime league onto his petition to, like, what was it, to recognize Owls as people? Well,. Most people recognize owls, or even most animals, as people. It's just this gear was the the odd one here, but he at yeah. least recognizes animal people as people now because it's in the name. Yeah. But you fired him, so that doesn't really matter anymore, does it? <laughs> well, yeah, I fired him from commentary unless he wants to come back, um, and he's still unless he gets a day off. <laughs> yeah, he's, yeah, he's still on the writing team. Though this particular uh, show, he didn't write. He wasn't there for that one. Yeah, it was just us. Yes. But at least we got shit done. Because Skier usually oh, yeah. suddenly starts talking about his favorite anime games. <laughs> yeah. This isn't yeah, a joke. This, this really isn't a joke. <laughs> but yeah, you, you may notice that our ring has both Japanese flags and American flags to... I, I guess... Like... This shouldn't be about the countries or anything, but yeah, I guess Japanese flags are pretty anime. <laughs> <laughs> and American flags may or may not have shown up in an anime at some point. Oh, okay, sure. So, so, how is the shirtless guy with sunglasses and angel wings not an anime, yet Big Scary Owl is? You ask the tough questions, and I am not <laughs> qualified to for. answer. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just say that um, neither of them actually care. 
<laughs> so this is the this is the mercenary match then. Yeah, it's just I know we needed some some openers so they are now doing this. Yeah, this is I'm quote unquote, I'm here to get quote unquote paid. Yeah. Even though you don't pay anyone. <laughs> yeah, we actually when setting up a match had a really hard time finding people who aren't anime. Yeah. Uh, Lazy Fire's here. He is now in the chat. I Lazy can't... Fire, get in here! <laughs> yeah, get to the commentary table, dumbass. Unless you don't want to. I, I would forgive you if you want to play like Metal Gear Solid 5 some more, because I, <laughs> I, I, I kind of lost track of time when I did that today. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, but hey, you look at that, the match started. They're, like, doing stuff that kind of resembles a fight. <laughs> yeah. Even though neither of them actually care about this epic <laughs> conflict about <laughs> this anime business. I, I don't think anybody cares aside from, well, Lazy Fire, Morton Cho, and Punji and Chunpei. Yeah. <clears throat> So who are we not at all impartially rooting for here? I'm not sure if if it's necessary to root for anyone, because neither of them... <laughs> well, Owl is technically on the side of the animes, much like uh, Lord of Butt is technically on the side of not animes. <laughs> but, but yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't know, I'm, I'm rooting for BSO just because BSO is pretty cool. Yeah, I don't even remember who I rooted for. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right, the bets. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, I, I voted, or I bet on BSO, so yeah. I think I did, too. I didn't bet on anybody, because it would suck if I won the bets and had to buy myself a game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, totally. Yeah. Oh, no, I've got to spend $9 on myself. See, what I will don't, I ever do? I, I don't need to justify doing that. <laughs> oh hey, Caterhell is here. It's been a while since he joined us, I believe. Unless, oh, wow. unless he's been quiet uh, in the chat the last few times. Amazing. Hey Caterhell, didn't you want to join us on commentary at some point in time? Because you totally still can if you want to. I'm here now. Hey! Hey! Deal with that effect. <laughs> it is Lazy Fire, although his name in the mumble is actually the mumble password. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's up with yeah. that? <laughs> I don't know. I've used mumble for years and I somehow still can't figure out how it works. <laughs> Good job, idiot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, it was one of those things. Oh god. Owl's just getting his ass kicked here. Come on, man. Uh oh. Really, is he? Because he just punched Lara, but really good. Oh. Yeah, he's doing okay. Yeah, he's. I think it's a, an equal match. Maybe. You can't tell it's a pay per view. Everyone kicks out of every finisher. <laughs> and all the matches are at least 30 minutes long, yeah. Uh huh. See, that's Owl kicking a man in the face. I think he's doing alright. Yeah. Okay, he, he was kind of getting beat there for a bit, and oh yeah, one count. Both of them are technically birds. <laughs> <laughs> Pigeon versus owl, who wins? Oh, he's supposed to be an eagle, I guess, but he's more like a pigeon, you're right. Well, I see the huge white wings, and I imagine pigeon, because I don't really think of white wings on an owl or an eagle. Yeah, yeah that's true. Could be an albino eagle. They have those, <laughs> right? Sure, that's a thing. Uh, well, I guess um, the uh, the pattern here is to just pull the table apart if you're in a fight. Yeah. That'll work. I hope it breaks. Oh, don't worry, we got tons of them in the back. I uh, know we. Oh shit. Oh well. Uh, we on. um we only have one, which is rebuild it in between matches. Because this is a. Uh... Oh. Well, this isn't good for us. No. I can't stand for long due to medical conditions. Please rebuild this table and or finish the match. 
<laughs> yeah. We, we are quick enough to uh, finish rebuilding it during the loading screens. Which either says a lot of... Win by count, up. Win by count up. Oh. oh, that won't be good. We haven't had a count out yet. Uh, I don't think, I don't you're think gonna we see ever will, yeah. Yeah, um, I feel like the AI is smart enough to get in. In, yeah, in, uh, in WWE 13, which we used for the old LPFWA, we had tons and tons of countouts. We also had tons of tons of people being put through the barricades, which was awesome. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh boy, that oh. thing. Two weeks in a row with that. Well, Owl just crippled a man. <laughs> and uh, apparently it doesn't even do much damage. No. Yeah, someone said last week it was like zero damage or something like that. Yeah. But hey, it, it's good for like, um, for the drama, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Only we just took the magic away by saying it doesn't do any damage. Yeah, a little bit. I just like the, uh, the idea of dropping a man on his head on, like, oh. probably wood or something like that. It doesn't really do anything. Yeah. Which says a lot about the wrestlers we hire. <laughs> well, yeah. Mm. I think we established last time that since we're on the moon, we have to go with moon gravity. So those dudes are really massive. Because that gravity seems like Earth gravity. Yeah, that was pretty ugly in terms of gravity. Mm. I think we're, uh, we actually are on the moon, but we're also spinning really fast, forcing some purple motion that creates Earth-like gravity. <laughs> sure, if why you not? Look up, if you look up, there are fans that are just sitting, standing straight up looking down at us because of the centrifugal nature of the arena. Uh, actually, fun fact, this arena does not have a roof. Oh, oops. Yeah. <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. <laughs> People are just, like, floating out into space, like, uh, screaming no. as they go. Uh, nobody <laughs> is allowed to... Yeah. No, uh, nobody's allowed to jump, otherwise they will just fly off. Yeah. yeah, if every seat has, like, a harness on it with straps and everything. No one told anyone this, though. It's like, what the hell is this harness about? The <laughs> event starts, the, the roof attracts. <laughs> <laughs> And Something you know, tells me Palpatine designed this setup. <laughs> Just put that out there. There's no monster tricks crashing into it halfway through. <laughs> uh, I was going to think, like, maybe you charge him $36 for the ticket, but then you don't tell him that the oxygen isn't free. <laughs> this match has a lot of back and forth, which is surprising. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> This is the Irish maneuver in the works. Uh, this is the uh, best match e yet. Eclectic says it's all force fields. Haven't you people seen Star Trek? <laughs> I've seen an episode or oh two. Oh boy. Oh, oh come on oh. out. Yeah. I believe that's one for the anime column. Yeah. All right. Oh, that was a, the best match this evening yet. That's one for my <laughs> bet column at least. <laughs> Wait, there was another match or something this season? I this think he's being sarcastic. <laughs> Well, it might be the best match of the evening at the end of the day, we don't know yet. I still have to decide if I'm gonna win or lose later on. I'm sure it's a tough choice. Why is Jay more refereeing? <laughs> he has <laughs> nothing else to do. <laughs> oh. Okay. So let's make sure I don't forget to actually... Uh, Put in the results this time, down. which is what I did Maybe. last time. <laughs> oh yeah, oh, oh. do that. Huh. Might be helpful. So we may or may not have a, a cutscene now, I'm not sure. Like, I, I don't remember what we did. Me either, <laughs> really. Which is good. Really good. Yeah, this is, it'll be it'll be new for you too. Uh, yeah, that's one way of putting it. Sure, sure. <laughs> All right. Well, since Skier isn't here, I'm actually writing these down now, just in case you. I, I actually am. <laughs> don't worry. Okay, Everyone's good. Then I don't have to. Yeah. Everyone's reality will be accepted at the end of the show. <laughs> <laughs> Once you look into the pizza vortex, the pizza vortex looks oh, like yeah. you. <laughs> well, Jeffrey, Joe, what are you doing here? For like the first time ever, I think. Yeah. <laughs> uh, he's been in scenes yet. He's also been referee at some point. <laughs> but uh, he, he usually shows up without fanfare. Unless he's special referee, then he comes up with rules of nature playing in the background and he's... Oh yeah. <laughs> Actually, let's use him as special referee for the bonus match. Why not? 
Yeah. Yeah. yeah, let's <laughs> yeah. <do it. laughs> uh, but uh, anyway, um, yeah. I think it takes a long time to say ellipses. <laughs> it's um, he, he tries to say a lot with those ellipses, I guess. Yeah, um, Joe really kind of wonders whether Walter is the guy living inside Pyroi, but apparently Pyroi has somebody else inside him. Who is inside Pyroi? Was it Anime Kun? We'll never know. Uh, Anime Kun is dead. Yeah, that's true. You got, hey, got you, crushed you, by a monster you, truck you, on the moon. Yeah. <laughs> by Emperor Palpatine. <laughs> it sounds so yeah. more, so much more ridiculous when you say it all of a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> the weird turn of events. That... <laughs> yeah, I could, a, I could just you a... see you writing this, just going, "This is brilliant." <laughs> yeah, it is. Where did I put all that LSD? Here it is. <laughs> oh god. <sighs> oh god. There's heating in there too. Remember? <laughs> oh yeah. And so it's always a plus at 98.5 degrees. How much does an intergalactic space penguin actually, you know, what, what's his temperature? That's a really good question. Um, you, you do ask some tough questions. <laughs> I said, I, I'm the only man with enough courage to ask the tough questions around here in the LPFWA. <laughs> Nihilator was doing it for a while, but he gave up, so well, I'm here now. Well, Nihilator's still doing it. He just... He just doesn't Nobody show up much, anymore. much at this point That's, in time, yeah. but he might still try to reveal the secrets of Stanthgate at some point. Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> well, listen, with like what forty some odd custom wrestlers, yeah, of course he's not going to show up every fucking week. <laughs> yeah, we have How a few you? more actually, and um, like five I... more I need to make, but I kind of neglected that for the last couple of weeks because I'm a bad person. <laughs> Eclectic, if he's not intergalactic, then I, I need to understand what fucking galaxy he's from where there's a man who can eat a man and turn into another man with different skills. Yeah. <laughs> he's from Dreamland. But yeah, no, if, if you want to know the secret of Stan Gate, quickly Palpatine's behind it all. Uh -huh. Yeah. Palpatine is never not behind it all. They got him that monster truck so he'd stop being Stan Gating. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, who knows what else he'll do with it, I don't know. <laughs> Death Star didn't work out. I'm gonna go to Monster Truck. Monster Truck <laughs> seems a little bit more simple. Okay, I'm just gonna say we are on the moon. It might be a Death Star. Death Stars have been mistaken for moons. <laughs> <laughs> well, he did kind of act out the Death Star sequence from Star Wars that, on that truck car, so... <laughs> That's Pyroi. Yay. Representing the animes, because clearly he is an anime. There's no argument here. No, I, I don't think you could. Yeah, they they did make a Kirby anime at one point. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Uh huh. Is there any way he could go grab a hammer out from underneath the ring? <laughs> there is a sledgehammer. Yeah. So that'd be great if that could happen. If if he only did that. Um, note to myself for the future, make every match with Pyroi an extreme rules match and set the yeah. weapons <laughs> under the a ring to be only sledgehammers. Yeah. <laughs> I need to remember that. Write that down. For some reason that says the victory column is Pyroi no matter what now. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Who's he fighting? Alright, uh, final, final game. Hammer. Good. Uh, I looked. See, I could look. I, I, actually, um, that's kind of dumb of me. I have it in front of me, and I didn't even know. <laughs> Iggy, are you drunk again? I need to understand how this guy is not also an anime. He's Rorschach from uh, Watchmen. Yeah, yeah Watchmen is... they made an animated comic, so that... But that's not an anime. Therefore. That would be a cartoon, because it's Western. Uh, yeah. Well, how, does, how do we... Approach Avatar: The Last Airbender at that point. Um, it's not because it's clearly an anime. It's an no, anime it's for an anime. for people who hate anime, so they have a justification of watching anime. Yeah, but it was made by Americans, though. Yeah. Yeah. Which is why it's not an anime, but it's pretty anime. See, we we've got this weird gray area going on. 
I feel like that might be an area of compromise if the anime people weren't wrong in the first place. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, we, oh boy. <laughs> it, it's a shame we don't have any Avatar characters here to, like, moderate this whole war. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're neutral. I didn't think of that in of, time. The Switzerland of animation. <laughs> yeah. We should have we should have thought of that ourselves, but we didn't. Uh, what we went with was much dumber. <laughs> like um, you'll see <laughs> yeah. when it comes up. It's, it's you'll probably oh, hate it. I I like it though because I'm a horrible person. <laughs> Let me ask you: Did you follow through on my suggestion? Well, your suggestion is involved, and what we do with it in the end is completely up to you. Oh, it's fantastic. I just want to see what happens now. Let's just say it, it's it's kind of left, kind of sort of ambiguous to some extent. Nice. Mm -hmm. To a lot. Well, uh, yeah. I, I, ambiguous is the wrong word, but. 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 I, I should stop talking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll all see it. No one else knows what this idea was, so. Except It'll Loki. Loki later. was there. Oh yeah. Well, uh, sorry. Uh, and I forgot the details, so I just did something. Did he just press on his head hard enough to knock him out? Yep. Mm hmm. That counts, I guess. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Watch if you like go into like the spreadsheets and everything. That does more damage than dropping a man on his neck onto the side of the ring. Huh? Setting a man on fire in Inferno match does less damage than holding someone's head. Yeah, and. Knocking somebody's head on the edge of the ring does zero damage, while a soft push does some damage. Yeah. And there's some Tetris music in the background. Yeah, I noticed that. You couldn't at least have a Kirby theme playing for Pyroi? I could, eh. but I like that song, so I'm m maybe if the match is still going after that song's over. Who knows? You need to have more Russian wrestlers. <laughs> <laughs> um, who knows? Maybe one of them is Russian. Maybe. Uh, maybe but Final Gamer sure is the, the Russian space. Rorschach. Yeah, I guess Pyro is Space from Russia. Space. A space Russia. I guess yeah. he could be from the North Pole with the, the outfit. He could be from anywhere. No one can tell him where to be from. You could try, but I'm not sure if that's going to do anything. Yeah. How do you think that guy inside him registers to vote? Hmm. Like, can you really register to vote in that sort of living situation, or you have to just, like, kind of um, deal with it? I don't think residents of the moon uh, do vote, because... I don't think we have a government. I think everything's decided through wrestling, right? Yeah, of course. Which is why we have the weirdest wrestlers ever. Uh-huh. <laughs> like, we have King DDD in our league, that's quite something. Yeah, no, there's no regulations on the moon. Finally. It's a, it's a libertarian paradise, league. yeah. Yeah, it's like, there's a freaking Mount Rushmore carved into the side of one of the craters, and it's just all Rand Paul. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it was done with private funds, because that is a viable thing. Uh, you know what I just noticed? We don't have any purple shirt guys in the crowd, so I think oh. the Eclectic Tastes fan club is not here tonight. Well, that's oh, not boy, good, because like he's got a match. Yeah. Um, don't worry, his match is at WrestleMania 9. There might be purple oh, shirt guys there. So, they, so they're over there right now. Yeah. I'm not sure. No, I don't think purple was a popular color transfer. Yeah, no, I know what happened. They were here, but then when we opened the roof, they all flew out because they weren't wearing their harnesses. Yeah, they were just too excited for eclectic taste, so they all just <laughs> stood up at once when the music started. The lights turned on, they're like, yeah, eclectic taste. Uh, it didn't work out. <laughs> Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, wow. Anti oh, wow. wow. A submission. Like two seconds of that thing. <laughs> what the fuck? 
Oh, yeah, that's usually what happens oh, when you actually win by a submission. <laughs> I know, the, the sad part is, I'm rooting for anti-anime, but I voted for DDD. So I'm 2-0, I think, right now. Hmm. Well, yeah, because every match with DDD is actually a fucking ta uh, handicap match. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, yeah. You deserved it, Cat. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. So, next up, we do have Walter D versus Quantum Crayons, who we will call Alex, just so you know, because that's what you always call him. Hey, Alex. And uh, while. There's no way. Yeah. Anyway, Alex is pretty anime, probably, but he's also Scottish. Yeah. Yeah, I see that the next match is actually anime versus Scotland. Absolutely. Yeah, he's like um Oh, 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 oh. Look at oh. this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, it's actually Dash. It is. Not El Chad. Who is no. not Dash? Ah, uh, one second. Um a, a moment <laughs> yeah, of silence for the passing song. of El Chad. <laughs> Where's the freaking song? Oh, I'm the wrong playlist. Good. Uh, there. Ah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Today are days of our lives. <laughs> uh, Star Wars is one big giant soap opera. <laughs> uh, well, except when Palpatine shows up. Because yeah. he just runs people over with a monster truck. <laughs> <laughs> They've done that in soap operas. Oh, I'm sure. Oh, probably, yeah. At the end of an episode, kind of as a, as a cliffhanger, but it's not a cliffhanger because somebody's crushed and dead. Mm. Yeah, they, they do that on the Friday shows. <laughs> I just love that this song keeps playing whenever <laughs> these two are in the same room. <laughs> <sighs> but it, it looks like there's some trouble in paradise because Galen uh -oh. has fallen for the El Chad. Uh oh, it's, it's tragic. <laughs> yeah. Who could have seen it coming? Yeah, I mean the El Chad <laughs> is irresistible. If if I were gay and I had like Dash and the El Chad in front of me, I would go for the El Chad. <laughs> he's a mysterious. He's a mysterious Latino lover. I don't know how you could. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> I I can't wait to see how how this plays out in the future. Oh, it's gonna be great. And it, it's all because I made a slight mistake and played the wrong song at some point in time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the weird chaos theory that governs the LPFWA. Yeah. Who knows what happens today? I don't know. Maybe I I fuck up and play the wrong video at the end. <laughs> yeah. Or maybe I because I need to. You know, do something else. Yeah, but let's not get into that. That would be a spoiler. Again, Pal Palpatine's just in the background, just holding his forehead, going, "I can't believe I hired these two idiots." <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I can see that. <laughs> I learned all my Mexican <laughs> from a guy who speaks French. <laughs> <laughs> It's true, too, because he learned it from Midnight Light. <laughs> and even then, he didn't really teach him anything. I just He just tried to sell him the Buskus title. <laughs> I, I completely forgot what the foreign things he said actually meant, though. I think yeah. Midnight Light was with us writing at that time, and he suddenly whipped up a French phrase. I don't know what it meant. Uh. <laughs> oh, oh, really, Iggy, really? <laughs> Did you, did you get it? Did you get it? Please tell me. Yeah. <laughs> it's the second time I've done that, just so you know. Oh, God. <sighs> ah, the El Chaz theme music. Uh. <laughs> nope. Oh. <laughs> that was pretty clips. good. <laughs> yeah, that Soft is... Rock 105. Uh, I, I don't know why I like this so much. 
I'm, I, I'm, I'm in love with that song. I want to marry it. <laughs> <sighs> way to quote Darth Vader dash. <laughs> well, it wouldn't be Star Wars if someone didn't scream no. <laughs> <laughs> The music's still going. Uh -uh. Just keep Star it going. Just keep it playing, man. Yeah. Star yeah. Killer, you unfaithful bastard. Yeah, I'll just get the clone of Star Killer. <laughs> Maybe it is the clone. I don't know. Yeah, we're getting into some weird soap opera territory with those two. Four, maybe six of them. I don't know. <sighs> yeah. I'm sure it's all gonna make sense at some point. Yeah, or maybe no. that's no. the secret of Stangate. It was all clones. Hmm. Sure, why we not? We cloned Loki, and then we put Punchy's moveset inside him. <laughs> no, okay. sure, why not? And we also dressed... No, we quoted Punchy and put Loki's moveset inside him. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> this is clones and robots all the way down. You take two steps here of that walking over a clone. Oh. God damn it. Told you to clean this shit up. I, I forgot that... Walter D's entrance music is fucking metal. <laughs> and then he just kind of walks out. <laughs> Smiles. Yeah, my metal music. Yeah, yeah, guys, metal. <laughs> He's just so happy to finally, finally be in a match. The this, time. this is the closest I could actually get to the entrance that he wanted. Because it's really hard to get an entrance that's just somebody walking in waving at the crowd. <laughs> I wish you could make him do that backwards walk the entire way down the ramp. I wish just I could say. just make him stumble and roll to the ring. Oh wait, I can't do that. That's <laughs> yeah, my entrance. That. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. It, it's a little sad that I can't make it exactly that way that he wanted to because it's actually a simple thing. And Scotland comes to the ring. Yeah! Uh, yeah. He is what would happen if Roddy Piper were an actual Scotsman. Yes. Rest in peace. Instead of being from Nova Scotia, actual from Scotland. <laughs> also, I just noticed his chest hair is painted with the Scottish flag, too. Mm -hmm. It's not painted. It's it's just a uh, dyed it's blue, and he has a scar that's cross-shaped. <laughs> Gave it to himself one day because he loves Scotland so fucking much. <laughs> yes, he did. This is exactly what happened. I looked at the chat real quick, and I saw the cut-rate Klingon knockoffs, and I'm like, yeah, Scotland's not a Klingon nation. <laughs> 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 oh yeah. I also, should... yeah. Uh, apparently, Annihilated says that that's actually genetic. Every Scotsman has it. Um, uh, makes so much sense now. Might be the case. But I haven't actually seen the chest hair of many Scotsmen, or any actually, as far as I know. Well, that that probably hurt a bit. Starting off well here. You guys know it's gonna be a physical battle instead of a mental one. Wow, that's really surprising. Oh, well, uh, um, I was surprised too. I want my money back. I'm sold on that. You yeah, we're uh, gonna have one of those games where you try to put a ball up in the air based on how hard you think, but uh, yeah, neither of these guys could actually get it off the ground. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you should, by the way, pay attention to the commentary the in-game commentators uh, make when we have a match outside of story mode, which will be the next two. Because they usually just suddenly start talking about coal miners for some reason. I don't know why. I heard! <laughs> yeah. I heard them say these coal miners or something. I was like, I heard that wrong. I clearly heard that no, wrong. No, they do that all the time. I don't know why. WWE I... has it out against coal miners and they're just trying to insult them subtly. <laughs> subtly, all the time. Yeah. Or, may yeah. or maybe that's one of their big demographics or something. You never know. Yeah, you get out of the coal mine, you watch some fucking raw. 
Can somebody explain the coal miner thing to me? Because I have no idea. I don't know. <laughs> they expect yeah, all no, the wrestlers to die at 48 of black one? <laughs> <laughs> no, the, the WWEs run entirely off of coal power. Hmm. That would make a lot of sense. Considering Linda McMahon's uh, two Senate campaigns. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Oh, hey, Walter's stepping up and actually doing offense. Oh boy, what a suplex. <laughs> Maybe he can get another one. And he's getting in some punches yeah. now. Yeah, I think I think QC's kind of got like an unfair advantage here, seeing as how he's like two feet taller and a hundred pounds heavier than Walter. And mostly muscle on that. <laughs> yeah. 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 But who knows? Plus, like... he's wearing that utility kilt that Walter really wanted, but... Yeah, um... <laughs> Well, Walter wanted to, to wear a tutu, but I can't. Well, he didn't want oh, to. Oh yeah, he wanted to, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he definitely wanted to. Yeah, yeah, he, he wanted to. It's just I can't do it. Aww. Uh -huh. Otherwise, I'd be very happy to put him in a tutu, because I would put everybody in a tutu. <laughs> That'd be amazing. Next day yeah. review theme. <laughs> if I could do that, I would. And, oh boy, the Scottish punch. That's what it's yeah. called. Yeah. Huh, well, it looked like it hurt. He went flying. Is that supposed to be a play on the Scottish play? Uh, sure. yes, sure. I I sure put thought into that. Yeah, <laughs> I didn't just give him like Roddy Piper's move set and call the day. Not at all. Where's the part where he takes a bunch of speed with Hacksaw Jim Duggan? <laughs> Where's that move? Is that yeah. a finisher? Yeah, where? <coughs> I think the punch was his finisher. I'm not sure. Mm. Uh, yeah, where, where's the one where he gets in the greatest <coughs> fight scene of all time in cinema history with Keith David? Yeah, if that could be his moveset, set, was just stuff from that fight, that'd be great. Mm. Yeah, if I could do that. You, you. <sighs> I can do that though. Shit, I just have to make Keith David. Uh, that's that was one of the best parts of Saints Row 4 is when they actually replicated that fight scene with Keith David and Roddy Roddy Piper in game yes. for no reason. Yes! <laughs> when, uh, that, when they just randomly brought you to that, I'm like, that's amazing. Thank you, <laughs> Saints Row 4. Everything's worth it. Yes. Yes. I look back it's fondly on that scene. The I also yeah, like just count. I also like just calling in um, Roddy Piper as a homie. Yeah. Mm. Ooh, reversal. He reversed a spear? Wow. Yeah, he did. Yep. Like a fucking boss. This may be it, because uh, QC has been dominating this match so far. Ah, uh, looks like he got a... Yeah. Didn't get a rope break, but it just ended. Yeah, but, uh... Wall uh yeah, QC's like... Whatever. Yeah, QC's like, no, I'm bored with trying to break his neck. I want to do more damage to him. Fuck this guy. <laughs> Hey! Yeah. Hell yeah! Where'd you go, QC? The first victory for not anime. Oh, never mind, for Scotland. Yeah, well, it's not anime. Scotland is definitely not anime. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Scotsmen hate everyone. You realize that, right? <laughs> oh. I can verify that I'm one quarter Scottish. I was thinking more of the groundskeeper Billy line where he's just like, Scotsman hate everybody, but yeah, sure. Well, actually, Alex doesn't hate anyone. He actually goes up to people before matches and befriends them so he won't accidentally break their bones because he can't relate to them. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I feel nothing for this man. Crack. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, shit, my, my streak is broken. I voted for Walter D on that one. Ah, oh. mistake. You, you should Sorry, never Alex. vote for matches. Uh, vote against Alex because Alex always <laughs> wins, except at one time yeah. he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> he wins every time except for times he doesn't. That's yeah. it. Oh well, maybe I can get another. Maybe I can get another ninety percent run like I did last time. <laughs> yeah. I think you only got one wrong. Yeah. Oh man, it's Chunpei. Oh boy. Chunpei oh, wants oh. flaming tables. Of course. When does he never not? 
<laughs> the lack of oxygen in the ring tonight, I don't know if that's the best idea. And he always wants them now. Not later, when his match actually is, he wants them now. That's the, uh, the important thing is to get those things as soon as possible. Yeah. Also, I love the picture of Vince McMahon just sort of creeping over the chair in the background. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when we moved to the moon, we were forced to take the WWE's old offices. <laughs> yeah. I didn't, I didn't, yeah, actually, that I didn't notice that was just a Winsick Man photo in the background there. And uh, if anyone can tell me if that line is a anime reference, I would be happy, because I made that up because it sounded anime. <laughs> it's a samurai soul. Uh. It does seem pretty damn to anime. Yeah, there's probably a like a really crappy dub somewhere that has used that line. Yeah, uh, a cat or how? Right after someone says Ushirukun. I think you see is an SA. He should be. I've seen him there. I think maybe. Anyway, Uga Booga. <laughs> yeah, Ooga Booga. <laughs> Ooga Booga indeed. <sighs> anime has balls. Anime is pretty balls. So it is established now that we will have a Flaming Tables match today. <laughs> Some <Subs> okay. <laughs> <jobs>. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna turn out well, seeing as how like half the characters in that match are like bare-chested. Uh... Junpei is really the only one in danger of catching fire and having it be sustained. Yeah, because that the way that vest is shining, that's gotta be like flammable as shit. <laughs> well, it's his, it's his flame vest. He just painted it blue afterwards. Yeah. Then he takes it off, and underneath he's got another silk-printed vest that's. He yells, this is my final form, or something. <laughs> <laughs> yes. There actually is an entire frame without his vest. Uh, mm -hmm. but, but yeah, BNF, what he's saying here is basically, what a fucking weirdo. I'm glad BNF thinks the same thing I do. <laughs> Seems like a smart man. Yeah, he's always the straight man. Like, he is, uh... He is basically everything I am not. Which is mostly sober. Yeah, because all he Speaking can say of, is Ooga Booga, he can't not not be the straight man. He is the straight man, though. <laughs> okay, so now we will have actually, you know, the, the big, like, six man match. Yeah, anime versus anti anime. It's gonna be <laughs> fucking great. Well, annihilated, he is male, at least. Whether you want to call him a man is up to you. So you can also call him a green thing. Here's a, le here's a legitimate question. Who the hell is Roman Reigns? He is a person. He is a guy. Um, He's not the one who actually posted his dick on Twitter, right? That was somebody else. I, I, I don't sure. know. Sure! <laughs> Because somebody accidentally tweeted their dick on Twitter. I forgot who it was. One of the WWE yeah, guys. Yeah, he's the first person to ever do that. <laughs> <laughs> he's the first... Like, he's the famous person who did it. I... Yep, first one. You sure you're not thinking of Anthony Weiner? <laughs> no, I think it was Seth Rollins, though. See, the thing is, I read the WWE, or rather, Restless on Twitter thread, so I know things like that. Somebody posts their penis, I will know it. <laughs> Anyway, let me set up this match real quick. Wait, yeah. Is is Bret Hart on that roster? Ah, uh, he is. Why? Yeah. Why not? Legends, baby. <laughs> yeah, we but, also like, we also have Hulk Hogan. Jesus, but like, doesn't Bret Hart like absolutely despise the WWF and um, or WWE and everything it stands for? Actually, there's two forms of Hulk Hogan on he, that roster. Yeah, and uh, Bret Hart actually stopped hating the WWE. They're now, they're yeah. now cool again. Yeah, they're okay now. Oh, god damn it, eclectic. 
Wait, Maybe I... Owen Hart will drop in. Uh... Oh, too soon, man. Uh, the too... Canadian national hero. <laughs> too soon. Make fun of him. Uh, you, you don't make jokes about that. <laughs> Good one, though. <laughs> I I feel bad about laughing about that. <laughs> uh, for those who don't That's know, so Owen Hart was supposed to make his entrance from the ceiling hanging from some kind of harness. It broke, he fell and died. Now it's sad all of a sudden. <laughs> there, I yeah, ruined it. Yeah, it's 20 fucking years, damn. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let me pick all the wrestlers. This is harder than it looks. I mean, <laughs> the people on the stream can't see it, but you can. Yeah, it looks really, um, really bad. <laughs> like, the, the mm. method of moving around. Oh, yeah. Like, you can't see it on the stream, but I'll explain it to you. He picks the thing, and because he has to do custom superstars, he has to go fucking up and down until he finds the right person. There is no search option, there is no set of pictures for this. He just has to go up and down. Yes! Pretty much. That's really bad. Okay, we have a six-man tag match. We could, I think, make this an elimination match. Should it be an elimination match? I think it should be, so I'm gonna make it. I think it should be, too. <laughs> sure. I don't know, I guess. It is elimination. You've been outvoted already. I don't care if anybody has a problem with that, it's elimination now. DQ's off. <laughs> False count anywhere's on. Yeah. Let's make this, this amazing. This is gonna be a fucking knockout drag down fight. Let's not enable KO though, because KO ends matches too soon. Oh my god, we should do KO only. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay. Damn. Let's hope I actually set up everything correctly, because I'm known to not do that. But... I'm confident that... Uh, Loki will not suddenly be replaced by Punchy this time. <laughs> sure. <laughs> we can hope. You never know. So um, it's basically th three animes versus two dirty guys who just came in off the street and a decrepit old man. Uh huh. Seems like a fair <laughs> fight that the anti anime should have been easy. Yes, and you finally get to see the anime entrance with three people. That's gonna be great. It's great. It is great. It's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> hey everyone, I'm Mr. Connor. Mm. <laughs> I like that entrance. They're tagging the good girls. Is that what they just said? Yes. <laughs> sure. And I love their song. <laughs> <laughs> I, I need to. I, I I can't tell if the audio is skipping or if that's like actually part of the song. <laughs> oh, it is part of the song. <laughs> Yeah, that sounds, it sounds like it's a metal song that someone just threw anime lyrics on. No, 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 no. It's an actual song by a Japanese pro wrestler. By a Japanese or for a Japanese pro by. wrestler? By. By and for, probably. I will post the video in the thread again if you want. It's amazing. Oh. It's um, a cross-dressing Japanese pro wrestler. Ah. Uh, actually... Whoa, someone's... Working uh, the, on their car in the background there. Yeah, uh, actually, the the pro yeah. wrestler himself is um is Australian. Oh. But he's wrestling in Japan, and for his wrestling persona, he is a nine-year-old girl. And that's not the weirdest thing we've seen so far. No. <laughs> I like the lightning in the background. <laughs> yeah. That's what Palpatine will use to uh, kill an anime group. Yep. If he has yep, to. very appropriate. He should come in a monster truck, though. If I could do that, I would. <laughs> <laughs> Just That'd run over scared. the entire ring, destroy it. 
just goes through the crowd. Just fuck them all. And then they fight on top of the monster truck like it's the end of Metal Gear Solid, where they fight on top of the Metal Gear. <laughs> Uh. That'd be fantastic. I like. I think that should happen now. I think if you get a monster truck match going, that'd be great. <laughs> if I could, I would. See, I have better ideas, or we have better ideas in general than the game can actually support. That's too bad. It game is, should get better. Yeah, it should really get better. But actually, the next game got worse because it removed the story mode thing, which yeah. makes it useless to me. Uh huh. And to anybody with taste. Because nobody plays these games. Yeah. Nope. No one plays them, they just scrape custom wrestlers and then videotape it. Yep. <laughs> I mean, what else would you do? Oh, cool. Whoa, just yeah. skipped a little bit, and yeah, apparently Palpatine got out of that neckbreaker. No, they teleported, that's what happened. Uh. God, yeah. This is the first half of the great climax to this dumb feud. <laughs> yeah, the feud does go on for a little too long there, I think, but whatever. Well, we need to conclude it at the pay-per-view, uh -oh. of course, so we have an excuse to yeah. raise shit like that. We can't just have yeah, a Survivor Series-style match in a regular show, that would be overkill. Uh -huh. I mean, we did have a Royal Rumble at some point in a regular show, but... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that was That was not in canon, of course. Non cannon dark match. Yeah. We will also have a WrestleMania match today. We had one last week as well. Yeah, that was great. The fucking Roman columns and everything. It'll happen again. And this time, oh, Eclectic Taste will, will be the one who who gets schooled by the great one, John Cena. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do this uh, for as long as uh, it takes to ch for John Cena to lose. Did he just say no disqualification match again? Like it's happened multiple times? Maybe. I don't listen to those guys, so. Oh, I I pay way too much attention to it. Because <laughs> I mean, stupid video game commentary is amazing. It it kind of is. That's where we got sheer determination from. <laughs> I mean, they say sheer determination because that's an actual phrase people use, but we made it uh, our own. Still. Pretty good. It's a pretty good phrase. Ooh. It's uh, not looking good for the animes right now. Until that. Until well, I said something. Yeah. You can't say yet um, whether it looks good or not for the animes, or if not the animes for that matter. Because it's elimination and it's three versus three. So anything goes. Yep. Yeah, that is true. Anything does go. You turned off disqualification and false count anywhere, and it's a whole yeah. thing. Oh yeah, and that guy has a sign that says you're crazy. I just kind of find that amusing for some reason. It's a weird sign to bring to a thing. It's not the weirdest sign, sign um, believe me. Um, there is a sign that says put down your sign. <laughs> it's the same person who keeps bringing up signs. Watch it. Yeah, the thing is that there's the signs are always held up by the same people in the same location, so <laughs> they all have several signs. Did Annihilator just fall out of the ring? Maybe. Good question. So uh, obviously he's got to do some investigating outside the ring right now. <laughs> On a guy who's not in the match at the moment. Well, yeah. this is. <laughs> Going outside the ring, though, which is good because I like that. Yeah. So in the old like WCW WWF games where you could do that whenever you wanted to in tag matches, that's what would happen. My brothers and I would play that, and we'd all just get outside the ring and fight each other instead of being in the ring. Uh, did you play WCW Mayhem? That was the game where you could walk <laughs> through the entire backstage uh, part of the arena. They did that with the later WWF game where you could uh, throw somebody up the ramp, like Irish rip them up the ramp, and then go further back into the arena. I... yeah, actually, I remember you could do that. But that would lead to people running uncontrollably 20 feet straight up a ramp, and it's like, they could stop. 
I'm pretty sure they could stop. <laughs> <laughs> they could, but why would they? Because backstage is more awesome. Uh huh. I, I think w the last game that did that was Here Comes the Pain. Maybe? I'm not sure though. I have never even heard of that game. Is it, it a backyard wrestling game? Uh, it wasn't. It was a WWE game. Oh. I'm just it, gonna say it'd be great if there was a backyard wrestling game with custom wrestlers and storylines. Yeah, actually. Or rather, it would be great if they could just add a backyard wrestling arena or something to this game. Yeah, that'd be good too. Yeah, just looking at the Wikipedia entry for it. WWE Smackdown, here comes the pain, known as Exciting Pro Wrestling 5 in Japan. <laughs> <laughs> Is this good pro wrestling? Well, it's exciting. Well, uh, they, they probably have better wrestling in Japan, because Japan's kind of famous for its yeah. pro wrestling scene. Yeah, it's... It's a PS2 game and it's got a picture of like Brock Lesnar on the cover looking really fucking creepy and then like a woman superimposed underneath them near his crotch area. <laughs> That's actually the, the life he wants to lead. I forgot that, but that is actually like, what the cover looks like. Yeah, I like own that I game. Linked, I just linked it in the uh, Skype chat. <laughs> and why? I, I, I'll just go ahead and. Um, and link it in the stream chat because yeah oh yeah that does look pretty bad <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> see every time Brock Lesnar tries to look like he's a real big mini he just ends up looking really freaking creepy <laughs> he's trying to steer through your soul he's bad at that he has like uh -huh. kind of a like he's a really he's a, a nice guy face. He looks like a small baby actually. <laughs> a small baby with a really big muscular body. <laughs> the dream of all parents. Mm, well, it's yeah. Be in the WWE someday. Oh. Oh, <laughs> he looks like a child and he has giant muscles. Oh, is this puppy out already? Nope, um, he's uh, no. just choke. He's choking out stitches. Yeah, he's just doing what he does, choking Good. people with force. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Loki's body just snapped in half. Divine coffee bench. Am I drunk? Do you really want to know the truth? Are you caffeinated? Are you? <laughs> uh, yeah. There's it's your answer. not going well for Luki. <laughs> yeah. Luki's kind of had a little bit, bit of a streak of bad luck because he also lost to John Cena. Oh man, I was going to say if his teammates couldn't get him out of that because they kept running into each other, that'd be fantastic. <laughs> um, who knows, that might be how the match actually turns in to the favor of either of those parties, I don't know. Mm. Uh, who's rooting for him, by the way? Oh, Ooh. I'm I'm rooting for anti-anime this time because of course Palpatine's in it. We uh -huh. have three people who are for the anti-anime fraction and uh, five people who are supporting the animes here. Huh? Because of course. Whoa! Did Flamander just end up kicking Loki instead of <laughs> Palpatine there? I don't know. I looked at the spreadsheet, so I wouldn't know. <laughs> Oh, poor Loki, his tiny body can't take much more of this. Or any of that, in the first place. <laughs> oh there boy, yeah. Loki's out. Griff Hammer pinned uh, Loki. Let me write that down Are real quick. Are counting that as a separate loss for Loki as well? Or uh, no, it's like a kind of separate loss. Well, now anti-anime has a decisive advantage. Yeah. If the referee wasn't paying attention, probably could have had another person tapped out. You know, it, it might go back and forth now, we know, don't know. Yeah, the, the ref's just staring blankly out at the crowd. <laughs> With Palpatine's fucking potion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Palpatine's really pumped. <laughs> well, they're just basically using Griff Hammer as a fucking enforcer out there right now. Yeah. <laughs> 
He's been there for a while. Yeah. They might try to keep him in to actually, you know, pin him or make him submit. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, he's in a bad spot, I'm gonna say. Yeah, I think that's yeah, like, the plan. C come on, guys, you can't get down, like, off the ring and, like, just beat up stitches. Like, they've been doing yeah. that. Haven't well, they? But, but Griff is not to be fucked around with. You're in. Oh, God. Okay, now, now you're gonna Gross. see step some shit. Game. <laughs> I don't care how this match ends. As long as Flamander does his finisher, I'm happy. Oh, God, yeah, if he gets the worm off the <laughs> Uh, buddy, yep, yeah, alright, see ya. <laughs> um, I, I don't know if the, uh, if people who aren't in the, in the ring currently actually recover from, from their injuries or not. But it would make sense. Yeah, I wonder if Well, it would just, make like, sense, that's why it's better. not in the game. Uh-huh, yeah, <laughs> you just said it makes sense, and then you know why it doesn't make sense for the game to happen. It makes sense, and that's the problem, yeah. Uh huh. Basically, anything that makes sense in this league is an issue. So the fans uh, hold up signs that correspond to the wrestlers currently in the ring. I can select those signs, and I'm currently wondering who I gave the sign that says Big Papa Pump. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of yellow shirts. Ooh, in, I think in the... just got fucking stunnered. Mmm. The yellow shirts are punchy fans, I guess. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there's like... Yeah, there's six of them there. They're all bald with beards, and they all stand up and lean in the exact same way at the exact same time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm... I'm... Oh, whoa, uh, Jesus! Whoa. Palpy, are you okay? Probably not. Uh-oh. Uh, I think Griff's gonna go for a pin here. Oh no. Come on, G-Man. No, no, no. Oh, Ooh. okay. No, no, Flamander cannot lose until he pulled off the worm. Yeah. You should just have a match where it's two Flamanders so you can see the worm. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows, maybe if we still have time after the bonus match, uh, we can do that. If you want to see two Flamanders against each other. <laughs> <laughs> Who doesn't? Flamander divided like the against game. itself can't not pull off the worm. I still want to see that two Zor Buskus match someday. <laughs> yeah, that, that <laughs> Even has if he doesn't to happen. have the Buskus right now. Yeah. Uh, the crowd yells holy shit, by the way. It stopped yelling because because uh, Stitch just whiffs his hot tag. Which, oh. by the way, um, they always whiff the hot tag. It's a bug in the game. Oh. <laughs> or almost it's always. A bug it's in the game. It's incredibly rare that they actually pull those off. <laughs> it's, it's a game yeah, that's been out for how long and they still haven't fixed that, huh? They, yeah. No, they will not ever fix that. Yeah, oh, they, well. Okay, based on what I've seen over the course of this LP, this game is just nothing but bugs, apparently. <laughs> a series of bugs that came out as a game at one point, <laughs> yes. Yeah. Fun fact, the previous game was also buggy as hell. They rewrote the entire code for this game. It's still fucking buggy. <laughs> <laughs> it was the same people who wrote the code before, so nothing could go wrong the second time. And, and the game is exactly the same too. Like you'd think it's the same code, and they just updated it a little bit. But no, it's it's different code. It, they wrote it all <laughs> from scratch. At least that's what somebody told me. I'm not sure if it's true. I can't Holy actually. Crap verify that. It's just impressive that you could have that bad code twice in a row. <laughs> <sighs> yeah. The hero Griffhammer back in the ring. And he finally gets out the Getting his neck broke. Uh. Yeah. Worm! I want to see... Uh. Uh. No. I think he's going to go for a camel clutch. It works. He was about to tap, I think. Now, if he were to tap, he would have tapped already. Because if they uh, tap, they tap super quick, like just after a second. Stitch is just gonna follow him. Oh, this might do it. No, no, no. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, Flamander. Stitch out of the ring too fast. Flamander <laughs> cannot lose until he's done the worm. After that, he's free to be pinned. I don't. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Don't 
for um, the armbar. Um, just for your information, I am out of stuff to w mix uh, with vodka. Vodka mixes really well with vodka. Yes, I have two bottles of vodka. If need be, I will mix my one brand of vodka with my other brand of vodka. It's a good plan, I like it. I'll have to go to the fridge for that though, because my other bottle of vodka is in there. <laughs> <laughs> That's the point oh. to your fridge. That's where the vodka lives. <laughs> yeah. Eclectic's being salty as hell in the chat right now. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, actually, my one bottle of vodka is empty, so I cannot mix vodka with vodka, I'm sorry. So I bought... It, Iggy, you might know this, because we're in the middle... Ooh. Oh, Ooh, yeah, that yeah. turned everything red. Blood. Yeah, that's a bleeded. Oh, I just drag his bloody forehead all over the mat, that's my finishing. <laughs> Just one guy, but yeah, you were about yeah. to ask something. Which... I bought a beer called Warsteiner. Is that a good beer in Germany or not? I am not a beer drinker, but that is a very popular brand in Germany. So it's basically German Budweiser. Uh, Ooh. Well, I don't think there is an equivalent of Budweiser in, in Germany, because most beer allegedly is good, but I <laughs> I don't drink beer, so I wouldn't know. Uh, Ooh! Oh. Calvi goes out. Uh, so I guess Griff is de facto in this match now. Did Annihilated even fight yet? I. He has. He's yeah, been he, in a couple he was times. In. Yeah, at least I um, I hope that Flamander does the worm. He might get a chance. I know Griff. Griff just. I don't know. He thinks wrestling is real, so he probably beats those people up for real. <laughs> uh, um, who eliminated Palpatine? By the way, I didn't look for that second. Uh, that was uh, uh, that stitches. stitches did. Okay. Because Deep I'm stunner. I'm actually writing that down. Oh, oh and he I punched think the man bleeding from enough. his pants. Yeah. Oh, again. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's where he always bleeds from. It's like he's got a weak skin on his leg or something. This is... <laughs> it's kind of hilarious, that's a bug. People are only supposed to bleed from their faces. Huh. This is why you shouldn't wear white pants, Flamander. <laughs> ah, but they really don't like Griff. They know Griff's the most dangerous person who's been in this match, because he's, uh... He he's thinks taking it seriously. Real. Yes. <laughs> God, it's wrestling, it's wrestling, man, stop doing it. Ow, ow, ow! <laughs> bleeding from my legs! <laughs> you punched me in the face, which caused me to bleed from my legs. You know how hard you <laughs> with me? Yeah, that was a real hard punch. If it, like, punched a vein on the head and one on the leg burst, that's incredible. You punched me so hard, shockwaves through, went through my body and caused yeah. me to... Yeah. Like there's yeah. there's a series of events that has to happen here. Yeah, no, there there is so much blunt trauma in Stitch or in Flamander's body right now. That's him actually just pissing blood. Oh my goodness! I turned away for a second. Where'd Griff go? Uh, out of the ring. Back to his corner. Yep. Oh. He um oh, I thought did he was a... flying over at Stitches or something. You know, he did a tag move with Annihilated, and um they kind of you know tagged in yeah. or switched places. It looks that like the manor is about ready to go. Um, if Stitches weren't to save him all the time. Yeah, Flamander looks like he's just about to die if he can't stand <laughs> up again. He needs to do the worm though. Everybody wants to see it, even not the animes. I'll see a worm, yeah, sure. This is why everybody's nice even watching know. this match. They want to see the worm. Ooh. Punch him right in the helmet, that'll hurt him. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say, I don't think that's yeah. doing much. And we got a pretty sweet Mega Man remix in the background. Damn, that was gonna be a three count. It, no, yeah. I'm just gonna watch these two fight. At, at this point, you can probably say that everybody except Annihilated would be three counted if they are pinned, because uh, I think Annihilated has been in the match the least at this point. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, here you go. Oh, uh oh. Yes! Oh, oh yes, yes! 
Yes! <laughs> yes! His legs are okay. bleeding, his body is broken, <laughs> but he can <laughs> still <laughs> dance! <laughs> yeah, that just happened. Kablam! Fishing move. Griff gets up! Yes! Oh, yes! Oh, Griff no. now has to do two of also, oh, man, this is gonna be difficult to see. And it elated, I hope you are happy that you interrupted a gamma's worm. <laughs> that was amazing though. Oh my god. It was amazing. <laughs> oh man. Uh this is hurt Loki too. So he has to knock stitches out to get any anywhere get near uh, get anywhere near a pin. Oh, oh no! There goes oh. Flamander. One on one, okay, motherfucker. One on one. Oh boy. Nineteen oh. seventies throwback, motherfucker. <laughs> and that, that's I actually. Like... Oh my! This could be it. Uh oh. Oh no! Oh. No! 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 Oh. That's it. That's it. Come on, on. Griff. No. Just to the ground now. Yes. Get yes. It. Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> I think that counts as three separate wins for the anti anime. Oh Thanks. man. That was an amazing <laughs> match, though, I'm gonna say. That was pretty great. We saw the worm, that's all we needed, and it was <laughs> really fucking close. And it was. Yeah, well, once again, Grip is the powerhouse here because he's the only one who's actually fighting people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Loki doesn't, or Stitches doesn't, Sti Loki doesn't have any ribs anymore. <laughs> Stitches doesn't have any arm strength because Griff basically put him in the Vietnamese torture rack. Yeah. And Flamander is bleeding internally at this moment. <laughs> <laughs> People are probably gonna die. Yeah. <laughs> oh god. I'm glad that happened. Yeah. That was a pretty good match. Yep. I yeah. See, I don't even care who won. Because I'm clearly on the side of the anime is because I like Chochos. <laughs> <laughs> and next up, we will have the actual deciding match, the title match. The title. It's yeah. online. Will it be in the hands of the animes or the not animes at the end of this day? Well, seeing as how like Lazy Fire and Joe have a, a perfect record so far. Mm, but not in tables matches. But I have to decide if I'm gonna win anyways, so we'll see. <laughs> flaming tables, let's not forget. It's flaming tables. That's true. So, I am going to set up that match real quick. In the meantime, enjoy some... some music, I guess. What do you want to hear? I can play some anime music if you want. Or not anime music. Uh, yeah, let's not do anime music. Uh, how about the theme song of Team Dark Souls, which has not shown up as a team yet. <clears throat> That's suitably anime or not anime, because it's um, a western setting by uh, uh, an eastern team, yeah. It's, mm -hmm. It combines both, that's fair. Yeah, of oh yeah. Okay. Also, no one in the stream can see it right now, but like the main like uh, background image for WWE 2K13 or 14 is The Rock screaming into a microphone, but he's also got this weird smoke effect on him, so it looks like he just emerged from like an industrial furnace or something. <laughs> he's like steaming. <laughs> The true sequel to Terminator 2 had the Terminator climbing out of the, the pit of molten steel, just like that. He looked like the Rock. <laughs> I need to. Then he to... began a pro wrestling career. I need to figure out how to make a tails match. I know I can do Is it. Is it specialty? Uh... Um, that that explains Schwarzenegger's cameo in the rundown. Mm. Ah, there it is. I found it. Ah. Alrighty then. You just selected the ladder, I thought. Ah, uh, wait. Let's just be on the safe side here. Oh yeah, I selected the ladder because I am a very intelligent human being. Who sometimes <laughs> makes mistakes. Don't worry. But don't worry. I have some buddies uh, covering me just in case I fuck up. Hey, oh, yeah. I'm here to help sometimes. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, didn't I say, like, last time I was here that the co-commentators are basically your safety valve? <laughs> they are. Only when we give a fuck, though, that's the problem. <laughs> and sometimes they don't. Sometimes they just want to see me fuck up, so they don't say anything. Yeah. Well, I said something there because I don't think either of the people on my team could climb a ladder without shattering it. <laughs> <sighs> At least, yeah, no, there, there, needs, there needs to be some kind of, like, jury-rigged, like, crank system involved. Yeah. Pick me twice. <laughs> that almost happened once. Yeah. Uh, it cannot happen though. I just checked if it was possible, and it's not possible. <laughs> it just won't let me do it. Okay, so let me turn off flame. Uh, turn on. Excuse me, flaming tables. Uh, elimination cannot be turned on, unfortunately. But I think you will be fine with that for now. Yeah, we'll be okay. Okay. The match is now currently being loaded, and now we have an anime as fuck song currently playing. Of course <laughs> you do. You know what? I'm not gonna stop playing that for the match. In fact, I'm gonna stop it now and start it again for the match. Oh, I see. <laughs> because that's just the kind of guy I am. <sighs> kind of a dick. Sometimes, yeah, but I'm, I'm pretty open about that. And that song again, I love it. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> All the enemies need the song. <laughs> I, lo I love it. You know, you, you may not god. know it, but I have a very diverse <laughs> taste, and I do like death metal. I like this song, ironically. I, I really like it. I just love how satisfied they are with their little, like, hand motions thing they just did there. <laughs> Very good job, guys. They worked on that for like three weeks. Just practice it for 45 minutes straight backstage. That song's also it's hilarious because it's the most weeaboo song ever. It's basically <laughs> just lists a couple of things that um, people who are not from Japan like about Japan. <laughs> <laughs> like anime, ramen noodles, and stuff like that. It's amazing. Sake. I don't think sake is mentioned even once. Which is kind of sad, to be honest. Yeah, you'd think that'd come up. Because e even if you're not into anime, you might like sake, because it's pretty good. <laughs> uh, uh, have you seen Eclectic Taste's idea for the title for this week? I was just gonna mention that, yeah. <laughs> That's uh, perfect. Where is it? Where is it? It's just their, uh, let's play, let's pray Flamander Worms again. <laughs> Actually, this is fantastic. I'm going to... That's perfect. That's gotta be it. Like, if you have other ideas, feel free to post them. But, I will not care. Because that takes the cake. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Isma Sayu Ufuma Midnight Light? I know he has some <laughs> Japanese sounding <laughs> yep, yep, yep. name. You missed a couple matches. You missed four. This is the fifth. And you missed a three-way tag, or uh, sorry, a three-man tag, six-man tag match. It was amazing, I'm gonna let you know. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like Solid Snake should be floating in some water right about now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I really wish you could throw blue into other people like you can in Metal Gear, now that I think about it. Yeah. That was one of my favorite things to find out was when I was carrying a body and I just threw a person at a bo person's body at another person and knocked him out. It's like <laughs> found a new dick move to pull off in this game. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, the camera gets uh, so blurry. Where are you going, Joe? Oh. So this match Joe might might take a while because 
the AI yeah. is kind of sort of random about setting tables on fire because they need to use a finisher to do that. Yeah. And did Punchy just try to like clothesline Joe with a table and missed? Yep. I can't believe I didn't count as a table breaking move. <laughs> it's kind of random what counts and doesn't count. If I could make a cardboard box match, I would. If I could add yeah. every single dumb match type, I could. I absolutely would, because... Yeah, there's not even a casket match in this game. What you should really do is, uh... You should make a whole thing a Hell in a Cell night, or pay-per-view, and call it the cardboard bo box memorial <laughs> match. <laughs> <laughs> um, technically the cardboard box ring is the Buskers ring. Oh uh, yeah, that's true. Which we usually use for non-canon matches, unless they are somehow set at WrestleMania 9. <laughs> <laughs> just, uh, I picked up Joe, okay, wait, what? What am I what? doing? What in the world? You powerbombed him through the table! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> he must have decided to lose this match. I don't know! <laughs> I betrayed the anti-anime alliance. Oh, he's, he's, only you knew. he's just in, he's so he's in blood rage mode right now. He's just beating oh. everyone up. <laughs> I don't get it, but it's okay. That doesn't make any. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That whoa, table's table. going crazy. Oh. The oh. table is possessed. It's oh actually my. what caused me to do that power bomb. Good God! What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I am enjoying this. I think a little more than I should. <laughs> we just picked up a table, put it down, and then put it back up. <laughs> it's now three then, versus one because yes. Lazy Fire has defected to the animes all of a sudden. <laughs> I told you I'd decide if I wanted to win or not. Also, Joe just passed the table to Punchy, and Punchy crashed it into him. Yeah. <laughs> oh my. And the collected case oh. whips up another That's great title, but it does not yeah. surpass the first one. <laughs> oh, tele teleporting tables. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think what? that's, that's got to be a second a secondary title for this match. It's I pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> it is. Yeah, the, again, the, this game is just a series of glitches that somehow coalesced into a playable form. <laughs> They were actually trying to make a side scroller, but <laughs> <laughs> this is a side scroller. Can't you see it? You just have to look at it from the right angle. Oh, I I know what the uh, the non LPFWA subtitle for this should be. <laughs> it's not a bug; it's a feature. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I'm going to ask a mod to change the title of the thread. <laughs> yes. I'm going to PM Chiop tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, run DDT there. Let's see if I can pull that off on Joe afterwards. <laughs> I think I just made Loki bleed. <laughs> oh my. I'm having a good time right now, that's good. <laughs> Remember, Lazy Fire is on his own side. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think he just powerbombed uh, Immortan Show to test him. Yeah. <laughs> is he strong enough? I've never found out. <laughs> is he strong enough to be set on fire? Yeah. Yeah, is he ready for this? <laughs> well, he, he is awaited in Valhalla. <laughs> oh my. I think the issue with me winning this is that I just wouldn't want to use the fuel to light the table on fire. <laughs> I want to know how I just phase through Joe there. I, just... I love how the announcers don't know what to do right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, of course they don't. And we are the announcers. If we knew what to do, we wouldn't be here. Uh huh. That's right. They would have replaced us weeks ago. You're too competent. <laughs> competent. Oh, oh. You're speared into a table. But but the anime song's over now. So let's uh, pick a different song that's not anime. What is suitably not anime? Pretty much anything that's not from Japan. Uh, I think this is gonna hurt Loki. Mm. No, Loki. you reversed it. Most of the songs I have sure. here yeah, are Jun remixes. Junpei. Whatever. Same person. Oh my. <laughs> All animes look alike. Yeah. Well, with Standgate, mm. you never really know, do you? Oh, uh, yeah. 
Listen, I don't know who I'm fighting. I clearly power bombed someone who was on my team earlier. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I've also put Jinpei through like three tables. The oop, and then myself. Oh, oh my one. goodness! <laughs> there has not been a single table set of light yet, and I think we're out of tables almost. Uh, so, oop, I just got kicked on the side of the face. Yeah. I love uh, the tilt shift blur that keeps happening. That it clearly doesn't know what to focus on. So, like, uh -huh. half, the, half the screen is just blurred completely. And yeah. That's usually where the action is happening. It, and it, uh, and uh, it kind uh, of blurs it. Uh, like, only, like, a particular depth, I guess. It's weird. It, I don't get it. Just set Loki on fire while he's against the table. Or not Loki, Jesus Christ, jump bag. All animes look alike. <laughs> oh my. I don't know why, you should have made this song that came out too roundabout, by the way. Oh. I know that wouldn't have been an anime. Ooh! Oh. The rare, the rare back spear. Yeah. Just Christopher walking that motherfucker. <laughs> Yeah, watch Junpei never stands up again. <laughs> yeah, he's not even standing on his own power right now. Uh, okay. Um, what oh. am I gonna do with this? Oh, oh boy. No, wait, yeah, there we go. Uh, you put yourself through a table, oh. goddamn. It wasn't even on fire. Just set the table and Junpei on fire. I know. Two birds with one yeah. stone. It's not yeah, hard. So yeah, set Whoa. Junpei on fire first, then put him through the table. Bam, you that won. <laughs> oh. uh, I was going after Joe again. I can't wait <laughs> until somebody finally manages to put the table on fire. I'm probably the only one who's near a special at this point. Then I just got nailed in the back of the table, so... <laughs> I just yeah, love how when it... tables in the ring. Mm. I think I may have just been kidding. Yeah, t tables for everyone. You get a table! You get a table! Everybody gets a table! Yay! <laughs> but yeah, I was gonna say, like, I love how when the camera zooms out, like, just... Punchy having, like, a big, bald, yellow head, a white shirt, and blue pants, he kinda looks like a very muscular Homer Simpson from a distance. <laughs> That's what he initially meant to be, I'm sure. <laughs> Alright, uh, whoa! I just got uh, cut into a table. <laughs> because, yeah, that's a thing that can happen in real life. Yeah. Well, we're on the moon, so the gravity works differently. <laughs> table versus table, who wins? <laughs> Clearly Joe's. Joe has the stronger table skills. Well. Oh, uh, wait. Oh, Punchy wait and Lazy it. Fire fighting over the table. No, I had to put it in the corner where it belongs, obviously. <laughs> as long as it isn't on fire, it's okay. By the end of this match, no one's going to be able to walk, and everyone's just going to be like, flaming tables can't happen because no one can stand <laughs> long enough. This match might take a while, just so you know. It's suitable for an anime match. Yeah, it might just take ten episodes of people yelling, who knows. <laughs> uh, listen, this isn't even my final form. <laughs> Isn't it? Well, you've got a form that has even less clothing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You boots right off. But, but... But that's usually not shown on LPFWA, it's, um, it's usually only shown on VHS. Mm -hmm. it, like, we have DVD technology, but we only usually use VHS. Yeah, because we're old school as fuck. Uh-huh. It's, it's a classic. It's a classic. I don't know what your problem is. And plus, you have more of that feel and texture with VHS. There's something physical there. I also only buy, buy vinyl records. Well, yeah. Oh! <laughs> Ooh. And <laughs> of course, the table. Oh, yeah, the table. I think that's the vinyl all the records time. of video format. Uh huh. I record all my videos in Laserdisc. <sighs> Set the table on fire. Stop putting it in the fucking corner. Do you also have Betamax tapes? Uh huh. Well, <laughs> I also listen to only 8 tracks. They were like, this is a 2012 car, sir, and I said, I don't care. 8 track. Uh, I might set this on fire. Nope, just gonna leave it. 
Powerbomb Joe again. <laughs> <laughs> I thought he was going to for a second. See, I, yeah, I thought he was going to put him in the camel. I forgot all back. about that for a second, so now I remember and I'm glad. Oh. <laughs> should we go get that other bottle of vodka? <laughs> I should get my other bottle of vodka, but I don't have anything to mix it with. Except mineral water, and that doesn't really count, does it? Yeah, I don't know if that works. I could try it, though. <laughs> <laughs> wonder if there's beer on the sun. <laughs> there probably is. It's just I don't, I don't drink know. Beer, Let's send so. Zor there and find out. <laughs> He's so bright already, he probably knows. <laughs> That's why everyone who had wrestled him for the Muscus had to wear uh, sunglasses. Yeah, he was like obtained the, the power neon. of the sun. <laughs> that neon ninja, the Zor. He has a part-time job as a sign in Las Vegas. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just walking away, just walking away. It's cool, it's cool, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> Hit me with the table. Yeah. They both set oh, him on fire. I'm... They both set these on fire. Yeah. I'm kind of no, disappointed you didn't. On fire. Lazy fire. I'm kind of disappointed you didn't do the Lord Humongous voice. Just, just walk away. <laughs> just walk away. <laughs> Leave this place. It's not worth your lives. There's been too much bloodshed. Yeah, you can do that for a while. <laughs> you we can just grab do. this ah, table. <laughs> yeah. Ah, I don't want it. <laughs> It's like, excuse me, sir, this is dangerous, please relinquish it to me, and then just throw it, throws it away. Sir, I don't think you know what you're doing with this thing. Some... I started a, I started a, a Guns for Toys program, and it was actually <laughs> just tables for guns. It's weird. <laughs> yeah, somebody set the freaking table on fire already, though, because that needs no! to happen. Move him! Move the table! <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna, oh. like, this match is gonna end in a fucking draw, and we're gonna just decide to have a fucking moving company. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> can, we, like, can we cut to- Oh yes! Fire? There it is! Oh, what? Oh! Come on, Joe. Against all odds, and uh... Oh set boy, set another table like on fire, come on! Yeah, uh, shit! Uh, yeah! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh! I decided to win again, even after powerbombing my own team. Holy <laughs> shit, that was fast! Yeah. <laughs> 20, 20 minutes of build up and then it's over in two seconds. It is an anime. <laughs> oh, Midnight yeah, Light, you, you don't speak too soon. Anime might have yet yeah. another uh, ace up its sleeve. Who knows? Maybe oh, even an fuck. ace that it didn't know about beforehand. Because <laughs> there's always a secret hidden technique that has to come up. Don't Are spoil it. I'm not spoiling anything. And even if I just did, people wouldn't get it. <laughs> this is good. This is the point. I can't stand up. Because I just got hit in the face with a table like a dozen times. <laughs> Two pegs on fire. It's a yeah. Oh my god. I pin, I job, I pin again. Witness me. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you're technically not walking out the ring, by the way. No. You're still in the ring, canonically. Uh, just so you know. Canonically. <laughs> canonically? Gotcha. Yeah, we're, we're having our drunken stumbles afterwards, <laughs> and then I go back in the ring, gotcha. <laughs> canonically, you're we still, drunk. still in the freaking ring. <laughs> oh, okay. I brewed up oil. I brewed up alcohol using cat food. <laughs> <laughs> I'm drunk as hell. So let's, um... Let's actually change the disc too, because this technically was outside of story mode. It'll uh, give you a, a little bit of behind the scenes info, which is not relevant at all, so I shouldn't give it, but I do anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck the police. Especially the police, yeah. Mm -hmm. They're the ones who made you switch to disc two for no good fucking reason. Because <laughs> the discs don't have any information on them besides the game, so I don't understand why you have to switch discs. You sure they weren't trying to make a side scroller? It is a side scroller though. It's just kind of. It's not really just two D. It's um. It scrolls to the yeah, side. No, Look if you w walk to the left and the right. They were trying to make a social media app, and they somehow accidentally made a wrestling game. 
<laughs> yeah. This was supposed to be a Call of Duty clone. What happened? <laughs> Somebody fucked up at some point, and QA didn't notice because there is no QA team, which explains a lot, really. Yeah, so QA is a drinking bird placed over the yes key. We got you guys that breakout license. What have you done? My God, it's a wrestling game. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh my God. But yes, uh, things are about to happen. Things. Lazy Fire, I'm. Things. I'm not sure if you like what is about to happen. I'm not oh, sure. I like all things. I no. Does it, does it involve another monster truck? Yeah. No. Um, um, is, like, well, is Palpatine just gonna descend from the rafters well, and just crush the ring with yeah, the truck? Or, well, uh, Palpatine's gonna descend from the rafters. Well, the <laughs> let's not get ahead of ourselves yet, okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I think the descent from the rafters move was probably taken out of this game. Yeah. <laughs> if you just hit down and hit the jump button in the ring, you'll be able to go through it, though. Side scrollers. <sighs> It's a side scroller. It's established now. Um, <laughs> it's just reminding me of that Bojack Horseman episode where the uh, the director's trying to figure out what the movie is, and they decide it's a fruit basket. <sighs> watch that show. I can't wait for this loading screen to end. Me either. <laughs> because I want to see how much you hate what's about to happen. Oh come on! Oh, oh, you, you, you'll see. It's gonna be great. Eh. Yeah. Oh, this is good. It's gonna be good. <laughs> of course it will be. Hmm. <laughs> uh, why do we have one more hit technique? Because you want to destroy the animes. Clearly. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite Western animations. <laughs> <laughs> we had this planned for a month now. And nice. <laughs> it's the dumbest thing. It does end the storyline, I'll give it that. Mm. Which Dragon Ball Z, though? That's the problem. <laughs> uh, I legitimately asked the question, is there more than one? Because I don't know. Uh, well, they did like, a like remake a, about yeah, a couple years like ago. Yeah, there's like Dragon Ball shit going on now, according to the people <laughs> I know who watch anime. Uh, see, I wouldn't know. Because I watch way less anime than you would believe. Um, Considering uh. that I support the anime faction here. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. But yes, apparently. And now everybody's friends. Aww. United under Aww. Dragon Ball Z or something. Or something. <laughs> I don't know, I, I'm kind of disappointed we don't get like Humongous Joe or something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what That'd will. Be fantastic. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. damn it, Iggy, I want my fusion. Maybe at some point in the future. <laughs> <laughs> it's something that I'm, I would have to edit, probably. <laughs> <laughs> yes, everybody is friends. Everybody's happy now. That's, um, that's a good ending to the story. <laughs> it does finish up the storyline nicely. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> It ends on a huge amount of contrived bullshit that just disappoints everyone. This is anime! It's anime as fuck. Don't Look, you just question it. Out there's like at least five types of Dragon Ball. Yeah. And we didn't even yell at each other for like five episodes in a row. Huh. <laughs> and no, charge. It just took 20 minutes. Yeah, it didn't even take us that long to charge up our special move. Well, it kind of did. wonderful night out tonight. Because it took us like 15 minutes to set the table on fire. So, that's the thing. Once that the tip was on fire, it got used. Uh, you're asking. Okay, so, yeah. according to Loki, apparently there's the original Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball GT, 
Dragon Ball Kai and the weird, awful Dragon Ball Z, which I, I guess they think he means Dragon Ball Super. Yeah. If you collect the DVDs for all seven Dragon Balls, you get a wish. Logan knows stuff about anime because he is the most anime because he's based directly off an anime. Except for Stitches, who is based off an anime director. Ah. Um, so, yeah, Loki pointed out, uh, the story's over, but his friend still got crushed by a monster truck. Yes. So, he's still mad at Palpatine, of course. Ah, of course. Palpatine didn't do that out of any specific hatred for animes. Yeah. Palpatine is like a hurricane. Palpatine just yeah. does what Palpatine does. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Palpatine does what Palpatine does. He doesn't care about anime or not anime. <laughs> what the? Isn't that... Isn't that Junpei's? Junpei has a the same entrance, kind of a similar one at least. When I saw him do that. I was like, oh, uh -oh Stan Gates coming back. <laughs> no, don't worry. That's just his entrance with a title belt because um, I have to select a different entrance when they have a title. Uh, or rather, I can't use a custom entrance for the title. So yeah, that's what that is. That's why Nufkin's had his weird ass one where he like materialized <laughs> several <laughs> items. <laughs> oh, apparently this match determines the fate of cats or rather faces Fedora. Of course. Why wouldn't it? Uh Cad, do you really want Face to lose his Fedora if he loses now? Make him fight Zora again. Come on. <laughs> Just keep giving Zor matches. I will give Zor matches, don't worry, I like Zor. He, um... More Buskus. Yeah. He has to keep fighting for the Buskus until he wins it again. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, you know he's gonna win it right away, right? And he will defend yeah. it like six more times. I want a rematch <laughs> for the Buskus. Yeah. I... I would... Really like to know what actual Sora thinks of this because he hasn't been around the thread much. Yeah, I would have left the thread too if my <laughs> best known quality was losing miserably week after week. Oh, come on. <laughs> it's all in good fun. Yeah, it is. I just think it's kind of hilarious. It is. So, how did this number one, uh, how did Pop get the number one contendership exactly? Um, we had no idea who to pick, so we just picked the first person who seemed somewhat qualified. Ah. <laughs> uh, this is, um, how we write LPFWA. It was also, like, the last not anime person left. Actually, yeah. so, no, no, he. Pomp is anime as fuck. Uh, well, Pomp, okay, okay. Pomp has a Chocho's uh, theme for the entrance. Just, you know. So it's anime. That will do things to you. Yeah. <laughs> Loki says, so affirmative action is the number one contender then? <laughs> yeah. Now we, can, <laughs> now we can have normal music again for the for the matches. Instead of stuff out of my library. Eh. Oof. Just pin him after that. Um, I, I'm kind of excited for this match because because Pomp is actually pretty good. Mm. It's a nice, uh, nice gimmick at the very least. And in the past, a uh, face. Or Caterhall, depending on when we are in the timeline of LPWA, has only held the belt for a short time, always. <laughs> <laughs> but that might change, who knows? This may well be the first time he held the title as face. Unless it also happened um, at some point during the part that I never covered. I just love the visual pun that Pomp is wearing pumps, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's not even a pun. <laughs> it's just a fact. Yeah. Oh my. And yeah, there goes the uh, the kick that's gonna yeah. pierce his sternum. Yeah. No, he... 
Yeah, he just drove like a six inch spike heel right into Face's neck. Yeah, I think Pomp wants to break Face's mask. Yeah, like, there's like a hole in his trachea at this point. Hey, you needed a tracheotomy, right? Here you go. <laughs> That's what I do. Uh, it's not gonna be beyond a one count. Come on, it's a championship <laughs> fight in a pay per view. Basically, we gotta kill the other person to win. Yeah, pretty much. Wait, who yeah. put who through the flaming table? I think it was Lazy Fire who put Loki through. It was me through. putting Junpei through, yeah. Junpei, just Junpei through, yeah. Not Loki, of course. Good I kept ever. calling him Loki, though. It was really easy to make a mistake. It's a mistake I would make, yeah. All thin animes look alike. Now that I'm a muscular anime, I can mm. say this. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, no, you're not supposed to subscribe for 5 euro, you're supposed to subscribe for 9.99 a month for the LPFWA network. Yeah. You can make the checks out to me, I will um, process your order. Yeah. If you want to support LPFWA, be sure to subscribe to the LPFWA network for only 9.99. It <laughs> will basically give you access to the exact same content you're seeing right now. Only you can see it knowing that you paid for it while others didn't. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Iggy, you, you should set up like a Patreon for this thing and have like $10 be like the initial amount. <laughs> Stretch goal, $12. No, there's only $9.99, nothing more. That's it. <laughs> and uh, it basically um, enables you to just watch the show like everybody else does. Gives you nothing at all. Except that yeah. you get to pay money for it. Yeah, exactly, that's it. Oh my, this is, I think, the finishing move. Uh, stink face, really? It's not it a stink sense. face, it smells really nice. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah I, I don't, again, I don't know how much damage that would do considering, like, Catterhall's wearing, like, a full on steel hockey mask. Yeah. Just gonna point out, there is a guy who has the worm as his finishing move. <laughs> huh. Yeah, no, we, we debated oh. like how much damage that actually does the last time I was on here. Mm. Uh, Loki, did you actually convert that into euros? Apparently. Oh, wow. oh my! Oh, oh my! Jesus. Championship changeover. Whoa, what? Whoa, what? Yeah. I looked Turn away, away for, for a second. Seconds. Pump just ripped Base's torso in half. It is like amazing. It yeah. Things happen sometimes. And then then everyone stop moving. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, uh, what, what, oh there we go. <laughs> they all just entered the spaces for a closer. moment. Yeah. Uh, at least he only has one belt this time. Yeah, it's um, <laughs> that's progress, I guess. <laughs> for the game, at least. Yeah, uh, it's learning from its previous mistakes that it will make them all over yeah. again next time it gets the chance. Mm. Of course it will. You know, I, I think I know what happened there. Pop ate the second belt. Ah, uh, yeah. First thing. <laughs> yes. Got handed a belt, they had to give him another one right away. Hmm. <laughs> <sighs> oh, good. So now we have the uh, Kawaii title match. Um, though I'm debating whether or not we should change the name of the title from Kawaii Title to something less anime, now that the anime anti-anime faction has won. Well, the anti-anime faction turned out to be part of the anime faction, so it's uh, kind of a moot point. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you're good at point there. Oh, look at that, it's Dr. Rath. Dr. Rath. Oh, oh my. Yes! Oh, is, he, is, he, is he gonna punch Fred? <laughs> this is the best. It's um, it's something. Let's pick the suitable music for that, I guess. I don't know. It's just a random song. Okay. So what Low day songs. did Wrath kill this week? Yeah, um, just... stab Zoroaster. <laughs> He's looking at me wrong. Hmm. Yeah. So um. 
It looks like Fred is just really, really sad he doesn't get to wrestle at a pay-per-view, which is understandable. So, maybe he's gonna challenge Raph for his title. Probably. Maybe. Only Raph doesn't seem to be too cooperative. When is he ever? Um... Sometimes. Probably. Like, he, he did eventually stop force-feeding Sims Magic and uh, holding him captive, so... Yeah. It took him a week, though. Yeah. But eventually, he, he stopped doing it. Bonus match! Well, the bonus match is the match you already know about. This wouldn't be a bonus match, this would just be an unscheduled match. If it happens, like if, if, big if. I mean, you can just, you know, strike through the if because you know it's gonna happen now, but I'm gonna say if because we pretend it, we don't know yet. Listen, if all the, all the little animaniacs out there they want to start praying for this match to happen. It'll happen. Just like Hulk Hogan <laughs> used to say. <laughs> then he said, take all your vitamins, but he kept calling his vitamins steroids. It was a whole thing. <laughs> and then he turned out to be racist, which is not surprising at all. Remember, kids, say your prayers, take your vitamins, don't let black people into your establishment. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, Hogan, why would you say that? <laughs> Yeah, it was when he was pushing a spaghetti maker, too. It was really weird. Well, he is a real American. I mean, there's nothing more American than good old-fashioned racism. He fights for the rights of most men. Yeah. <laughs> and only men. Exactly. Yeah. Not women. And, and well, most men because, of course, there's black people. Let me tell you, brother. The Constitution says all men are created equal. Where does it say women in there? Yeah. Also, not black men. They don't count. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> land pride. Land owning men. Whoa! What? what? Fuck, Sergeant Slaughter's here? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, I Same. forgot. Sergeant Slaughter's here. <laughs> oh, there's another thing I have to. Yeah, I'm not gonna tell you. You're gonna see. <laughs> I just remembered. Yeah? Yeah, I just remembered. <laughs> <laughs> it's a thing that happened in an accident, and we decided to keep it. We just kept it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Once again, it's not a bug, it's a feature. It is a feature now. Oh. Is this actually what? a mixed tag what? match? This is not a mixed tag match, no. They're just matchers. Um, like, uh, Aurora's gonna have a matcher as well. Ah. Uh, who's she gonna come out with? Uh, you'll see. Now. <laughs> ah, yeah. It's more of that show don't tell kind of thing. Oh, <laughs> 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 of course. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Aurora does have a t shirt that says, uh, Eat, Sleep, Suplex, Repeat. Or no, Eat, Sleep, Plexatron, Repeat, actually. Huh. So who's gonna win this one? Probably Private Scott, because she has uh, not only an actual sergeant commanding her, but she has a gun. Mm. <laughs> and plus, yeah, she, she's Scott, been the, I think. And she's won against John Cena slash Evil. Aurora hasn't. Yeah. That's true. Actually, that is very true. Because um, Aurora lost to John Cena. See how this goes. I still maintain Private Scott would be in the anti-anime alliance if given the option. Yeah. Even though uh, that's yeah, a dead probably. gun. <sighs> Sergeant okay. Slaughter changed his uniform. Yeah. <laughs> the 12 seconds it took between the openings, he changed. He did because he's just that good. That's what it takes <laughs> to be a sergeant. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, I gotta do stuff now. <laughs> oh. Yeah. <sighs> uh, Which um, way you going, ref? 
<laughs> <Don't watch. laughs> Obviously, an okay. excuse to beat up Paul Heyman. Yeah, yeah. No, no one needs an excuse to beat up Paul Heyman. You already have one. I guess he's Paul Heyman. It's Paul Heyman. Yeah. Yeah. Aurora's already got a couple of suplexes in. Uh, um, did you did you have to count Aurora suplexes? Just so you know, because. It's an LPFWA tradition, which we always forget, so we don't do it usually. <laughs> it's an LPFWA tradition we forget. I I would count the suplexes, but the damn blur filter screwing things up. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna try to fix that. Which Once I can. Once again, it's not a bug; it's a feature. Uh huh. It clearly is a feature, though. Well, it was supposed to have 2D painted backgrounds, but then look what happened. <laughs> Yeah, it's a side scroller, we know. Yeah, I'm not gonna let that go. <laughs> Man, Sergeant Slaughter's chopped block Paul Heyman like six times so far. <laughs> yeah, but you know, Slaughter gets in the real hard hits. Mm. And also, he Reversal. makes the screen blurry, it's his fault. <laughs> yeah? Brad Scott seems to be uh, doing okay. Uh, okay, I spoke too soon. She's got her chin mm. broke. Oh, oh, they broke the stairs. <laughs> Wave oh, those God. stairs at him. Oh. Phased through his body. Scott's going for the pin. Only one count. Ow, that's gotta hurt. Oh, yeah. It's kind of sad that the match happening outside the ring is more interesting than the one well, going on inside got thrown in. <laughs> sorry, leaving. Sorry, just gonna head out. Yeah, sorry. No, oh, now Paul Heyman's in. As, as long as I don't touch anybody, we should be okay. Um, uh, wait, did, what? What, did Paul just take a shortcut through the ring? No, Sergeant Slaughter just punched the person he escorted to the ring. No, no, he didn't, <laughs> he didn't punch her. He oh, uh, encouraged her. Yeah. Uh, to um, be better at whatever she does. That, that's why <laughs> power. You can do it, earlier. kid. I believe in you. Every fight is a ring fight. <laughs> oh, I would uh, love yeah, it if Aurora definitely, just definitely. Whoops. <laughs> oh, oh. Definitely just DDT Private Scott. Yeah. Oh, I would love it if Aurora just like suplex Paul Heyman like five times, even though like he's on her team. Yeah, but uh, I think Sergeant Slaughter has been ejected. Yeah, it looks that way. He just sends there a drink set, though, like, yeah. I feel like there might be signature moves in the future. There uh, may be. Maybe. Maybe yes. even. Oh my. Uh, uh, what? What? No, oh, <laughs> come on. God damn it, Paul. Sergeant Slaughter looks like he's waiting for the pin rather than getting ejected. Well, Sergeant <laughs> Slaughter has been ejected. He just wants to see the match real bad, so he just stays. I'm not gonna leave. This is a really good seat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the referee just accepts it, though. That's nice. Oh, come on, come on. Oh. Jeez, Paul. <laughs> One trick pony here, man. Yeah, man. That, that referee is easily distracted. Yeah, but Paul He's, Heyman doesn't oh, even. Oh, he, oh. <laughs> yeah. He ejected. Paul Heyman doesn't even care about the match. He just leaves. Slaughter, <laughs> even though he's ejected, stays and watches. Uh huh. Yeah. Slaughter was nice about getting ejected. Heyman. Yeah. Was he was yeah, okay. I will not interfere anymore. I will just watch. What? One, two, three. Four. Four. Oh my god. That's a lot of suplexes. Five. Six, There's that roll up at the end. Seven. Eight. Brain is just jelly. Nine. And she's going for the pin. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. A one that... count after that. Oh my god. Yeah, it is a, a custom finisher. Stuff. It's a custom finisher. That's what happens. Which is why Aurora wins mostly through submissions, because her finisher doesn't do damage. Ah. Ah, that's a lot of suplexes, though. 
It is a lot of suplexes. Ooh. And, ooh. <laughs> Sergeant Slaughter, you're blocking the view here, man. <laughs> yeah. Got my hat. Up, up. Two up. Oh, okay. Oh. I definitely think Scott's gonna win this, though. Oh yeah. Uh, you never know with Aurora. She sometimes just does things. Dangerous things. Remember that one time where Chunpei powered up and became an anime girl, and uh -huh. um, uh, sure. Aurora won even though she oh. was injured at the time. That's and a torture rack. A freaking torture rack, yeah. And oh my god! Oh, she tapped. Oh. Look, I said things would happen. God. A uh, good job, a uh, good job, Aurora. Yeah. yeah. Damn. Aurora is secretly a submission wrestler. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. No, that that was the thing. She she tried to fireman's carry her to get ready to hurricane Rana her, but in the process of doing so, she accidentally broke Scott's back. Oops. Yeah. It happens. Like, her finisher doesn't do any damage, but her submission moves do. Mm. But yeah, Aurora has the title back. Congrats, Aurora. Yeah, Aurora used to be our uh, our big champ, but she um, she didn't really get the title yet this this time around. No. Oh. Well, sadly, I, that's all the time I have, guys. I hope these next two matches go off well. Same right. here. I've got to get going, too. Oh, oh wow. Okay. Good luck, yeah. friends. Yeah, I see ya. Yep. Best of luck. I hope Fred wins. <laughs> yeah, we'll find out. I think Wrath's got this one. <laughs> yeah, me Later. too. See ya. Bye. If it happens. Like, we don't know if it happens. Will Wrath come to the <laughs> ring? <laughs> Okay, the only one people left on the commentary are the only two people that know what happens, so... Yeah, but will Wrath come to the ring? Uh, uh I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody knows. It's quite amazing. Let me actually first check if in-game um, we actually have the correct champion, because we don't know. Yeah, actually we have. Good. Because we we just might have a problem if that's not the case. I might have to change things, but I don't. Okay, just... Oh, right. The reason it's so quiet right now is because we don't have any music, so why not have some music? Good idea. The El Chats theme, as we've called it. This is harder to set up than it looks. I don't even know what I'm looking at. You're looking at nothing in particular. So, guys, what do you think will happen? I totally can't see what is going to happen. I cannot tell. Yeah, it might just not happen. Somehow. Mm. Okay, I, I guess we are all set. Oh boy. So let's see what will happen after this pre-match loading screen which indicates that there is a match happening. <laughs> and yes, Loki, we are using Mumble. Just in case you know you want to join us again. But we're also in Skype for the screen share. Yeah. Because last time uh, there was a delay and it kind of became an issue.
And hey, I think Loki is joining us. Look at that. I can already see him on the server. He's just on the wrong channel right now. Yep. And Fred is dancing. This entrance, by the way, I knew not, not what happened. But it happens. Because um, Hattie Master set that up himself. <laughs> so he didn't know about it. <laughs> Hello, Loki. Are you with us? Um, I guess. Yep. Yep, I can hear you. <laughs> oh my, that dance. Yeah, I know I, I have to set champion entrances, which is the reason I can't have particular entrances some of the time. Thankfully, Wrath's entrance, who, by the way, totally showed up, is absolutely not a custom entrance. It's just Randy Orton. And I'm really, really glad that Wrath actually decided to be part of this again. Because it took him a while to actually join LP for yeah. day this time. Even though he's been in the chat since the first episode again, only he isn't right now, which is sad. Alright, um, let me actually update the, uh, the bets. So, Aurora won. My submission, no surprise, that's what she always does. Wow, only one person bet for Aurora. <laughs> oh, that was Junpei. Of course, a Junpei bet for the animes, period. Uh, yeah, 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 that's right. So both titles are on the line because, you know, uh, Frederick Hope actually puts his title on the line as well. Yep. Whoever wins has both titles. And they think that um, Frederick Hope would be a fitting holder of the Blacks title. He's very happy to uh, have a match wherever he can. Yeah. That's just... That's just Fred Hope. And immediately, he just... He just, you know... He's really aggressive. Rats totally got this, though. You only say this because you're friends with Wrath. Now, hang on a second. Because Frederick Hope just really seems to not let Wrath do anything right now. Yeah, even if he reverses stuff. Oh wait, no, actually, never mind, there's a suplex. I just let Wrath know he's in a match, so hopefully he'll show up. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, right, he probably doesn't know about this. Even though he technically is on a writing team. He just almost never shows up. And Wrath is punching the air above Frederick Hope. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I hate to say it, but it seems like Frederick Hope is more or less dominating right now. No, I don't say that. It might change still. I mean, who knows? Things just might happen. What's this move, by the way? Holy crap. What in the world was that? <laughs> <laughs> did he just... It's like a cartwheel. Did he just do a, yeah, did he just do a cartwheel and then elbow him to the face? 
Is that just happening? I I immediately like Frederick Hope a little more now. <laughs> yeah, um This isn't the good for Wrath. Come on, buddy. You can do it. I know, you believe in Wrath. You always believe in your friends. But it just might submit. This might be the end of Dr. Wrath's reign as the um, uh, holder of Black's title. And then Frederick, Frederick Hope will hold it until Black returns someday. <laughs> oh, is that? I don't think that's gonna happen. Yeah, Black has been consumed by Fiat. Yeah. This is no joke, by the way. Black is a Fiat poster. I um, and we haven't seen him ever since. He um, I don't know. We haven't seen him in a while. A long time. Yeah. But then again, I, I don't actually browse Fiat, so I wouldn't know. Yeah. Maybe if you have a Fiat poster in here, <laughs> they could tell us if, if Black is actually somewhere in there. This is uh this is another good time for me to point out that Frederick Hope has lower stats than everybody else and yet he keeps winning. Yep, stats do not matter. Oh, uh oh. No! Oh my no! goodness! What? No! Oh. Frederick Hope is is a a worthy champion though. Um, both for the LPWA championship belt and for Black's championship belt. Because he just really likes to wrestle and he will wrestle chess with anybody. And who the hell is making that weird noise? Uh. It sounds like somebody's humping their mic. <laughs> okay, so we have, we have a winner in the bets, but they didn't put their actual name in. Um, they just put. I'm just here for the cupcakes. Yeah, so I don't, I'm not sure. I'm not sure who that is. I. That's not you, okay? No, it's not me. I already put my my stuff in there. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, no, I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea then. But whoever is just here for the cupcakes won, and I have no idea who it you is. Just, you just put that in the wrong uh, column. Uh, oh, right, I did. That's my mistake, though. And it's pin not submission. But, but yeah, whoever just was here for the cupcakes won, we need to <laughs> figure out who that is. Um. Because otherwise, otherwise I don't know. Yeah, I mean, uh, um, what do we even do? <laughs> otherwise, we'll have to give it to either Sands of Barham or Nine Gear Crow, depending on who called the outcomes more correctly. Which, in that case, I think would be Sands of Barham. Um. Uh, or no, shit, they're fucking tied either way. Holy crap! Uh, well, well, no. They are, I think. I didn't count correctly. Zanzibar uh, has one more than Nine Gear Crow on the calling, the type, like the type of win. Looks like to me. Um, I think one of them has submission in one part where they won by submission. The other one has pin in one part where they. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'll take a close look at this after um. Uh, after uh, we have our Eclectic Tastes vs. John Cena match. Uh, 
This is very confusing. Oh yeah, we have somebody who admits to be just be there for the cupcakes. Do you really don't want a Steam game worth about ten dollars? Because you can have one, or you can forfeit and give it to uh, Zanzibar. Probably Zanzibar, yeah. Like I'm fine with that, but you're entitled to like a ten buck Steam game. You're also welcome to cupcakes if you if you if you really want. Yeah. Cupcakes are basically free. Yeah. <sighs> okay, so the final match of the evening is about to commence and it's not even canon. Not that it matters what's canon and what isn't canon. <laughs> 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 because we just, you know, randomly decide uh, what is and isn't canon, depending on how we feel at the time. Oh boy. I would really like to have basic economics John Cena here now. Um... Didn't we say we were gonna make Referee Joe a special referee or whatever? Oh, you are correct. Thank you for reminding me because I would have forgot. Let me just try. Loki, are you still here? Because I think that sound may be coming from you. That weird, weird sound. I don't under. Yeah, it's gone now. Uh, it's like a weird pulsating sound. Yeah, I'm not sure what to think about it. <laughs> but yeah, special referee match it is. I could act as the referee if I felt like it. But I don't think I'm impartial here, so... <laughs> It's not like the referee chose impartial either. Is it working? Or can oh. you hear me? I can hear you fine. Okay. I don't know. I, I think because I was using Skype, it got weird. Yeah, I don't know. It kind of sounded like you were humping your mic. <laughs> <laughs> I think it just. I think because like it, it, it's confused with Skype. Oh, you were also using Skype at the same time with the audio because we have our Skype uh, voices muted because we just yeah. Use uh, yeah, I had it muted too. I think it just gets confused, like my computer confuses the two programs. I don't know. I don't know. Max up. I don't know how would I know. And we have some Ninja Gaiden music, even though the source not here. That's too bad. <sighs> but yes, the match is finally about to start. Because I've set everything up now. Do you still hear me? I can hear you. Yeah. Okay, hopefully that fixed it. Look at that, it's Referee Joe at WrestleMania 9. <laughs> <laughs> With Rules of Nature as his entrance tune. If I could have two special referees, I would also have Evil. Yeah. But for now, Referee Joe will have to suffice. He is LPFWA's head referee, after all. Is that why all the weirdness happens? Um, are you asking why all the weird stuff happens? Because that's just because LPFWA. Oh, I thought it was because he was in charge. Rock 
And now the time that the purple shards have been waiting for all this evening. And I don't think I see any purple shards in the audience right now. But in the in the chat on Hitbox you have plenty of purple people. Yeah. Yep. See, even I'm purple. I don't know why, but when I see electric tits, I'm thinking of an eclair or something like that. <laughs> Plenty of signs that just say I'm a real American. Yeah, Cat, okay, of course you're only half purple. You can convert to full purpleness if you want, though. And it's Sean Cena. You should totally check out Sean Cena's Twitter timeline and the responses to his tweets. Because they are all... They exist, let's put it that way. <laughs> but this is Sean Cena. I don't think I need to say anything more. He is the champion. And whoever wins gets that belt that he's currently holding. But I'm not sure if I set this up to be a title match, so I might have to transfer it manually later. But this is a title <laughs> match. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it is with, with my audience that most people have either a blue or a purple name. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's a uh, fault of how awful Hitbox's color picker is. Well, I, I mean, we have two shades of blue and three shades of purple. Well, slightly different shades. They are almost the same anyway. But they're different. Technically. Technically. Oh yeah, red is my favorite color, by the way. But I'm purple anyway. Really? Yeah. German guy likes red. Why is the music not playing? Uh oh. <laughs> I started it. It doesn't do anything. The music hates you. There you go. <laughs> yeah. It's Castlevania time now. That is like a weird rendition of Castlevania. It's pretty cool. Oh uh, yeah, I mean, it's fine. It's just kind of off. It's okay. There you go. Yeah, it's pretty Castlevania. Oh, I see. Now you're battling about your colon three ness in chat. What? No. You are. Flesh your best. Is Cena going down today? Probably not, but we'll see. Ha! I did it first. Any volunteers for next week's Cena, ma Cena match? I don't know. Eclectic Tastes might win it. The next week, Eclectic Taste will have to fight the title against somebody else. Against so, Time Traveler's match. Yeah, against Hulk Hogan, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> against whoever is currently the WWE champ, which might be John Cena, I don't know or care. But yeah. It actually does look like Eclectic Tastes might be able to pull this off. Uh, let's be honest, nobody's rooting for John Cena right now. Except for Vince McMahon. And John Cena. That was Near Fall. And Evil. But yeah, that was Near Fall. Almost a three count here. Man, I kept running him around the other time, the last week. Yeah, he was getting one counted. Yeah, Eclectic Tastes is now um, avenging you, or trying to. 
Oh my god, the five knuckle shuffle. <laughs> That's just like a derivative of the rocks move. Not really. The rocks move is way better. And it's an elbow. <laughs> and the attitude adjustment. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Yes! No. Oh. Everybody's rooting against John Cena. Not for a taste necessarily, but against John Cena. Anyone who beats him is a plus. <laughs> Eclectic tastes? I don't even know what your finisher is, to be honest. I know you chose it at some point, and know I, I said it at some point, but... I don't know what it is anymore. Nobody kicks out of a Stone Cold Stunner. Or the added adjustment. That was pretty cool. Yeah, it was first the five knuckle shuffle and then the added adjustment, so that's even more impressive. But John Cena refuses to give up because spoilers he wins. No. Of course he doesn't, at least not for now. And the crowd goes wild in the background. I wish you could understand what they're yelling. And I think we're gonna see the five moves of Doom. Uh. Uh, I don't want this to happen. <laughs> Well, it's gonna be a continuous thing, that's the point. <laughs> Handicap man! This Handicap is the worst! Man. Please be partial, referee Cho. No! <gasps> Reversed it, yes! Uh huh. Huh? Oh, it's a one cap, but he reversed a freaking added the adjustment. I'm so glad, I can't even tell you. At the very least, I'm glad this isn't over yet, because... No, 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 no! Yes! Come on, eclectic taste. Uh, We're all rooting for you. This is riding on you! Yeah, for once, everybody is united. Except that one John Cena fan who doesn't count. <laughs> oh boy. Come on, Neclector Taste, this is your chance to become the man. <sighs> Jesus Christ, John Cena's just doing stuff. No, no! No! Stop! Stop doing that! No! <laughs> He's not even hitting him! <laughs> no! Reverse it again! Come on! I believe in you! Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. No! One, Stop! Two, Stop! No! This is the saddest moment of my life. Uh, <laughs> it's even worse for eclectic tastes. Because <laughs> he was so close. He was so close. <sighs> so who's gonna fight Sean Cena next week then? Um, BNF. Sure, why not? Let's have it BNF. BNF can fight Sean Cena. <sighs> you know what? I'm not a big fan of John Cena. <laughs> Putting it lightly. <laughs> I'm not sure why he keeps winning. I'm really not sure why. 
because he hates us. Yeah, probably. Except for the kids from Make-A-Wish Foundation. Which probably means Wrath should fight John Cena at some point. Oh, that's, 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 yeah, that's a really good idea. Yeah. Kind of is. But yeah, this has been the final match of the evening. And much to, uh, much to everybody's. Yeah, it's, it's sad, but John Cena actually fucking won. It, it's not even like it's evil, where you can say, yeah, it's evil! Yeah, it's just like... <laughs> it's John it's Dread. It's John Cena. <laughs> yeah, thank you all for joining us and witness the glorious end of the... of the uh, storyline with the animes, but... Wait, what's this? Is there something more? Oh... I'm not sure, is there? Is there now? There there ought to be. Yeah. There might be. Never mind the shit that's just new here, but... Hey, look at that! Morton Cho is apparently out to watch some DBC with people, but... Oh my goodness! No, come on! <laughs> Seriously? Does that mean Lazy Fire is now dead or does it not mean that? Who knows? Because as the Martin show says, he may or may not be dead now because monster trucks are his only weakness. Find out next week. Yes. Next week when we do some stuff which we don't know yeah. yet, but it'll happen. It's gonna exist. <laughs> We're gonna see what to do with it. Maybe. We didn't think this through. This is no, this is another good title for LPFWA, but I think I will actually message Chiap with it's not a bug, it's a feature. <laughs> That's what we're gonna do. Yeah. Yeah, everybody's dead now. Um well not everybody. Not, not, wanna see it again? <laughs> that's that's rude. <laughs> God damn it, Pelvin. No. Bad dog, bad, very bad. <laughs> Not again, Jesus Christ, Poppy, stop it. <laughs> Seriously, though. <sighs> so that just happened ten times. <laughs> Yes, can somebody <laughs> make your gift of that? <laughs> I, I mean, I could, but I don't want somebody else do it, please. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's, oh boy! It's almost a little sad. Lazy Fire wasn't here to see it, <laughs> or a Morton show. Or anybody involved except us because we wrote it. <laughs> or, or no, no, wait. Actually, it was just me. I did it this morning, literally. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Anyway, thank you for joining us for this thrilling conclusion where one person got run over by a monster truck at least ten times. <laughs> and if you want, I can make it happen another couple times, but I think we have enough for now. I think I think the joke is worn off. <laughs> what joke? It's serious business. <laughs> oh yeah, sure. I'm sorry. Somebody just died. Probably, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, but again, <laughs> thank you for joining us. 
uh, we had more fun than we probably should have had, but we had it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, see you all next time, when we ha hopefully have figured out what all this means. <laughs> probably not. Yeah, see ya. Goodbye.